start. All placed away now. Odds in, evens go in. And the green light goes on. There's no more bets, thank you. Echo Fick and 420 favourite on the fix just before the jump. We're set to go. Away, last out, Echo Feckham, but it's a bunch group going to the lead. Best in red for late mile followers. Sets up a big lead. It looks big enough, you'd think. Now, I'm a Bogan's making ground. Then in turn behind those, we've got Cape Thunder also trying to make some ground as well. Was Polish Jewel, Victor Kate, Echo Feckham's trying to get into third placing. Then in turn was I'm a Bogan, but in front, it's best in red. Too good for late mile followers. Cape Thunder second, Echo Feckham third. I'm a Bogan behind those. In Victor Kate, it beat a couple home. At the tail end of the field was Polish Jewel and Byron's memory was always at the tail. The time around 23 and 10. Good one for late male followers. She always begins well. She's a little freshen up. She's come out bang straight to the front. Probably kept a little bit straighter. Usually gets really, really wide on occasions. But uh, yeah, still got wide, but probably not as wide as she normally does. Five and a half lengths the winning margin. They bunched up early. She was able to cut across. They were all bumping. And she set up that big lead, which was uh, what she maintained for pretty well most of the distance. Running into that last bend, she uh, she got down nearly down to the rail there at one stage. But then uh, usually she swings about 10 wide coming into the front straight. But she kept about four or five off. So uh, that's good to see. Six, one.